idea from Burundi Preschool. This is where you come into our community centre. Just join us and come on through. I'm one of the educators here. When you come into the room, we ask you to wash your hands. Welcome to our play space. So if you come on through, normally our sign in area would be over here. And Um, and then we have free play. So the children can choose any of our areas to play. So we've got a play station or a, a cutting craft area. We have a free craft area where the children can choose their own resources. Um, we normally have a literacy table and we always showcase a book. So we showcase a book throughout our programming cycle, which is we program fortnightly. Um, we have a small world area which gets changed throughout our program depending on the children's interests. Monday, we have maths focus, we have um, numeracy focuses, we have a quiet reading area. We have a block space. And every day, we do some journaling, so um, where we read a book or a prompt or we have a, a set um, activity that we do and the children draw about what we've asked the question. So in their journals, and then they take their journals home at the end of the year. We always have a home kind of space, so currently we've got an office set up, so they've been busy typing away away their letters and things. We have painting or collage at our easel, so at the moment we've got collage happening with some natural materials. Our bathroom, where the children can access themselves. And then the best part about our yard is, is our yard, sorry. Come on through. We've got a beautiful yard at Barandita and we love to utilise it as often as possible. So we come out, in here, out here in all sorts of weather. Um, one of our focuses is our Stephanie Alexander kitchen garden. So we, we plant kind of paddock to plate stuff. So we teach the children about growing their own food and then we utilise it in our cooking and take home produce for our families. So We've got a very productive strawberry patch, that's one of our favourites, um, which is quite a popular, quite a popular um, part of our program. The children love helping us water the garden and plant the plants and all of those sort of things. So, we have our beautiful, our beautiful sandpit. And the children access this however they wish, depending on what's going on. Sometimes it's construction, sometimes it's cooking and they cook us up a storm. <laughs> we play lots of games on our beautiful grassy area. And we do lots of building and rolling and racing and skipping and tumbling, depending on what we want to do. Um, we're trying to encourage the natural birds back into our habitat. Hopefully you can see those. And we quite often see fortunate enough to see kangaroos hopping across our oval. We've got our climbing area which we change on a regular basis depending on the needs of the children and um, one of the most popular features of our yard is our spins where we're quite often swinging ourselves. <laughs> then we've got our digging patch where we can get down and dirty. <laughs> and the boys and girls love it. Quite often digging for dinosaur bones and we make all sorts of lovely concoctions over here in our digging patch. Lots of gross motor stuff, so we, we roll tyres, we move tyres, there's lots of different ways that the children are using these resources. 
this place is, is an area where we utilise, depending on the weather. So we can we can get under here when the weather's a little bit inclement, or we utilise the sand pit as well, as well. So we're still getting our outside time, even when it's raining. <laughs> we have our beautiful shelves that the the children can select their own resources, and again they use them for the most amazing things. <laughs> they love to draw for you. <laughs> So we've left some of the drawings here for you to share um, and they change on a daily basis. Thank you so much for coming through Baron Hope to hopefully we see you as soon as possible.